My name is Greg Roth. I'm from Milford, Nebraska. And I have been on the Jason Pearson weight loss diet for three years now. Um, originally, I was 285 pounds. I've lost a total of 120 pounds. I'm now at 160 to 165 pounds. That's where I range in. Um, originally, what got me started was uh, I had type 2 diabetes. Um, I wasn't getting along with the pills that the doctor had given me. Uh, every time I would try to eat better while being on either metformin or glucophage, it seemed like it was counterproductive. The pills were more set up, the pill regimen was more set up to help you to continue to eat the bad foods that you're in, and then you would try to uh, make corrections in your diet to get out of the diabetes and lose weight. They would be counterproductive and you had all kinds of digestive issues with them. That was my experience. Um, when I went to my doctor originally, he said, here's your pills, go home, find yourself a good nutritionist, lose weight, and you'll be in exercise, and that's how you would get rid of diabetes. I said, well, where do I find a good nutritionist? He goes, well, find a good nutritionist, usually at your local hospitals. They said, just remember one thing, there's good ones and bad ones. And so I didn't, uh, when I immediately went home, I tried doing things myself, had a terrible time with that. Every time I would uh, research a nutritionist, they would always seem like, tell you, okay, you have diabetes, you need to learn to live with your diabetes, and that's what we're gonna help you do, learn to eat better. But you're going to have to come to the realization that you're just going to have to learn to live with it. No, I didn't like that answer. I wanted to be totally cured of it. And uh, after finding out about Jason's weight loss plan from a friend and visiting with Jason, he said that's all uh, pretty much a misnomer. He said you can be healed of your diabetes. So I got on the plan. I was seeing it, it was like December 31st. My feet were tingling and one day I just made the call and I just jumped on and got started. I never told my doctor about it. I just uh, went ahead and did it all on my own. I didn't seek anybody else's advice medically. And within four weeks, Jason me had off all my meds and I probably could have been off within three. Um, weight loss went very quickly. It was very, to me, the menu plans were very easy to follow. Um, with that much weight, I still lost it in a fairly fast amount of time. Um, really, there was no struggles along the way. Sometimes I had some my own uh, battles with wanting to cheat once in a while, but it wasn't too much to overcome those urges and just continue on. Uh, when I went in for my checkup, every six months the doctor had me come in. I walked in there lighter and off all my pills, and he literally looked at me with his mouth open and said, who, how, and where, and when did you do this? And he wanted a name and a phone number, and I gave him all that, and he said, well, just stay here. And all of a sudden, he was bringing the rest of his staff and other doctors through to see me and, and basically asked me how I did this. Because up to then, he said, I've never had a patient do it before. Um, so three years later, I'm still holding my weight where I'm at. Jason, once we got into the different phases, uh, Jason said, well, would you like to take up running? I said, well, I've never done an athletic thing in my life. And so I was first opposed to it, but he goes, why? I said, well, it sounds painful. He goes, well, you gotta do it my way. So once I started following his exercise regimen, it was uh, somewhat amazing to me how simple and easy it was. It was painless, um, and running is pretty much effortless. And so I'm a farmer by trade. I've never participated in any sports. And after I started developing a running regimen, Jason goes, well, I would like to enter some races. So I did enter a few 5Ks. And the first, actually the first race I did was a 10K and I had a pretty major accomplishment there. I finished quite high in my age bracket and I was very shocked with myself. And from there on, I started getting more and more competitive at it. And so that's the reason for I've been on it for three years. He's uh, helped me uh, train for more races. 
I've done my first marathon last fall, a half marathon, last uh, May, and uh, done several other races and I've finished very well. And so I wanted to become more and more competitive and we're going to work on that this racing season. So um, what I'd like to say to you is there's no time like the present. And being a farmer, I, and I know it sounds complicated and some people that they have a hard time cooking or uh, following these recipes and the things that it gives you, but it's really, if I can do it from the seat of a combine on tractor, anybody can. So I encourage you to stick with it and I think you'll be pleased how it turns out.